What is up? What is up? What is up, FS Club? Welcome back. Welcome back. Why am I going so slow? Hold on a second. We're having technical difficulties here. Uh, why am I going so slow? Uh, probably because we're at 0 0.2 speed. That is... I say that's pretty slow. <laughs> okay, so B to increase speed. How do you... Okay, standard speed. There we go. So wonder what was going on. Yay, that looks better. Whoa, why am I so fast? Like Speedy Gonzalez over here. Jeez. Okay, uh, it says standard speed. I don't know what's going on. I think I broke the game. Okay, anyways, we are not going to be running today. <laughs> As you can see, we are a little too fast. We've been drinking a lot of energy drink. <laughs> Gotta have that monster. Okay, but plan for today is we got $6,192. Okay, this just this feels weird by going this fast. Really, really too fast. Okay, let's try this again. Take two. Okay, here we are back. I think I figured it out. See, look. There we go. But I do also still have super speed if I wanted to. See? Watch. There we go. <laughs> but we're not going to use super speed. Okay, today, what do we have planned today? It is the sixth day of spring. Well, it's late spring, I should say. If we go over to this right over here, let's see. Uh, 50s, and then let's see, summertime, 70s, 60s. Ooh, we're gonna get some rain on the first, well, the second, third, fourth day of uh, summer. Jesus, it's gonna be a really rainy summertime. That's uh, really unusual. Okay, but what are we planning on doing today? Since we are up above 50 degrees on the soil temperature, we are gonna be planting our soybeans. But if we go over here to, I gotta get used to not pressing that button. Okay, where are you? We got a planter somewhere. I think it's over here. Maybe nope. Over here. Okay, maybe that maybe that uh, running really fast might help out a little bit. Getting to the yard and back quick again. I don't know where it is. Is it over here? Hey, we got to wait over there though. Um, no. Do do we even have one? Maybe we don't have one anymore. There's our plow, which looks really, really dirty. Okay, there's that. Let's go over here real quick. Yeah, see, it's right there. Where the heck is it, though, on here? Oh, there it is. Okay, this thing right over here. We are going to be selling this. Uh, this thing's too small. We need something a lot bigger. Also, we added uh, global companies onto this save game. So what does that mean? If we go up here, look, it actually tells us how much is on there. Herbicide, 2,000 liters, 100%. And then if we go over to here, as you guys can see, the icons have changed on the top. That is so cool. It is only on PC, guys, because this is custom scripts. Sorry, guys, but pretty cool. I love the new icons. Also, factories have been added. So I might introduce a factory maybe here and there during this Let's Play if we get enough money because we are broke, broke, broke still. Okay, but we have lime, so let's get in here. Put this thing up because we are done with this thing we have to get ready to start seeding don't mind my driving okay put this thing up real quick as you guys can also see the snow finally melted took a minute but it's finally nice to not see snow Springtime. Okay, let's put this thing up real quick. Okay, there's that. Okay. How are we going to get this money? Uh, let's see. How much is that harvester we're looking at? Um, this one we can get about 23000 for. And we have enough power to do 176 So let's go over here. Let's go to Cedars. The one I really want is this one right here. The Rapid A600. I've always loved this one. 180 horsepower, so it's a little bit overpowered, but it is a lot better. Look at that. Six meter working with compared to three meters. So that's double it, but it is also $76,000. So it's not cheap, not cheap at all. So the first thing we are going to do is we're going to go on a selling spree right here. We're going to go sell this, and then we're going to come back here, get a trailer. Wait, you know what? We might actually lease a trailer. That's what we might do. Might go ahead and go lease a trailer. Because if we lease a trailer, let me see the. Let's go over here real quick. 
Uh, 10,000 corn, 15,000 sunflowers, uh, 15 canola, oats is a 7,000, 33,000 on wheat. See, if we did that, that's like three or four trips with wheat. If we can get something just to borrow for right now, it makes it a less trip. Even if it's only like a $2,000 loan. I'll tell you one thing though, it is a very nice bright day today. Okay, go to the store, sell this. I've been selling a lot of stuff, you know that? <laughs> I am using controller right now. I'm thinking about switching back to the steering wheel. Actually, yeah, let's switch, let's switch over to the steering wheel. I drive a little bit better with it. Okay. Hopefully you guys are all liking this series. I am loving this map. And it's awesome that this is the first... Uh, First map I'm doing seasons on. I have just started, just started a time lapse series. Uh, that's actually fun. Because basically it's just me just, you know, farming away. And then after that, it's basically just editing it, putting music in it. So basically I get to uh, bas basically play the game and not having to talk. <laughs> Which is very unusual for me. Why is the turn signals on? Oh, this thing ain't even open. Okay, let's fast forward time a little bit. Oops, wrong button. There we go. Open sesame. Come on, let me in. Got a purchase to do. Okay, how much are we going to get for this? Okay. Oops, press that thing a little bit too hard. Okay, there we go. Okay, let's check this out real quick. Okay, if we still sold it straight up, it would be 23348. 23348. 23348. Okay, so I bought almost an extra $5,000. So that's not bad. Okay, we got $34,000. We need about forty more thousand dollars. Oh. Oh wait, we did say we we're going to get something bigger. So let's try to get let's 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 check these prices out real quick. Uh, trailers, uh, this thing is 21000 and how much it would it be to lease? Only $1,000, that is not bad. Uh, this thing is 31000 this thing would cost 1700 Do I think that this thing can pull that, though? Hmm. Let's lease it. That way it pretty much carries most of the wheat. Because we're going on a selling spree. Yay! Oh yeah, this thing is heavy. And just think, we haven't put no grain in here yet. I think the first thing we should sell is probably the high-priced stuff. And that way we can try to get to that, uh, what, 76,000? As fast as we can. Just hopefully don't have to climb up these hills with a uh, full trailer. That would suck. Stop, 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 stop. And you know how we do it. We're going right across the field. Oh, jeez. Bump, bump. Oh, I thought tires uh, tires would be turning white. Now they're turning a little bit. Am I leaving tracks? Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, why did you have to leave that little bitty space right there? Okay, that's a tight space. We need to uh, cut those down sometime. Uh, okay, let's see these prices real quick. Yes, yes, save. Okay, so six oh six twenty one at the grain elevator for wheat. Uh, barley not so much. One one thousand forty five at the grain elevator for uh, sunflowers. Well, not for sunflowers. I mean canola. Uh, sunflower price is a little bit down. 
but it is looks like the highest. So where can we sell this? 1046 at the east north uh, port. East north port. Or at North Cooperative. 1,000, where's North Cooperative? Oh, it's just right up, right up the road, basically. Okay. So let's do... No, not soybeans. There we go. Hopefully this gives us about fifteen to $20,000 right here. Okay, 50% full. I don't think this trailer is very suited for this map right here. Okay. I'm gonna keep the map on so I don't lose my way. Stop, 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 stop. So most of today, what's going to be happening is us trying to sell as much as we can to get that new seeder. That is pretty much it. And if we have enough time, we're going to try to start seeding. Oh yeah, we're also going to have to... Oh. We're also going to have to get some money up before we can buy seeds. Because if we don't, we're not going to be able to plant. Because we're going to need actually a pretty good amount of seeds. Okay, I'm just going to go for it. Hopefully don't hit nothing. Wide turn, wide turn. I believe right down here we are going to have to try to make this hill. That might cause us a problem. Might. Okay, where is the cooperative? Uh, right up here and then it should be to the right. Oh, come on, 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 come on. I don't want to be stuck. I don't want to be stuck. Yeah, see, everybody else's crops are coming in. We haven't even planted yet. Come on. So we are getting a late jump at it. I, I just hope we're going to be able to harvest everything before uh, before winter hits. We're, trying, we're making a gamble here. That's what we're doing. Okay, let's see how much... How much we can get for this. Okay, sunflowers. Here we go. Up to 40. Up to 51,000. $18,000. Not too bad. I wish we could have got a little bit more. Because we need to probably close to about thirty to $40,000 more. Maybe I need to sell that wheat real quick. I am going for it. You know me, I don't like stop signs that much. So we have a lot of selling to get to to uh, get to that to that at least eighty, ninety thousand dollar mark. I mean, forty thousand dollars. Oh, it would definitely help if we had some. Uh, oh wait, we have canola still. So that's probably like another fifteen thousand right there. So that gives us about sixty-five thousand wheat. Uh, I say probably about seven to ten thousand dollars right there. So we should have enough if we sell every single little piece of grain we have. I just can't wait to get the so the soybeans in the ground and then uh, harvest them because that is a lot of money. That, that's the kind of money we need, and we have to pay that fifty thousand dollar loan before uh, before winter hits. Well, fifty thousand dollars onto the loan before winter hits. Okay, let's stop right here. Okay, let's get the next crops. Uh, canola, it is. Okay, let's start selling all this stuff.
Okay, that should hopefully be enough. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go to the store. Take this thing back and try to also uh, get us a cedar before the store actually closes. You can tell one thing. This thing is heavy. But it served its purpose. We sold, what, about fifty, sixty thousand dollars $60,000? Well, actually more than that. I mean, about fifty, anyway, about fifty, sixty thousand dollars $60,000 worth of uh, grain. Yeah, if you guys seen earlier, it was struggling to get up these hills with that full trailer of wheat. I mean, it's, it's struggling just to get up this hill right now. And this thing is completely empty. If you look, if you look underneath the speedometer right there, it actually tells you how much, uh, how much this tractor actually weighs with the trailer. See, so 8.5 tons, and then with the trailer, it is a total of 17.1 tons. That is pretty heavy. And just think, I think with with the wheat, uh, with the wheat, it was like what 76 tons. So that is, uh, <laughs> it's a lot of weight to be hauling with this little B class tractor. I mean, th this ain't a large tractor. This is just a medium sized tractor right here. I'm starting to actually get to know this map a little bit. That's why I turned off the uh, the map at the bottom, so hopefully I don't get lost. I know it's uh, down here where we gotta make the turn to get back into town. I just hope that store hasn't closed yet. Because we're gonna have to get that. We're gonna have to get a bunch of seeds. So I wanna try to get these seeds in before, uh, before tomorrow. Before the first day of summertime. Oh, geez, that is one heck of a turn right there. Uh, looks like the store is still open, so that is a good sign. They can take back the leased equipment, and we can start uh, start getting going. Okay, another wide turn. Okay. You guys can have that back. Thank you so much for that. Whoa! Gotta get used to not pressing all the way down on that. Okay. Uh, let's see. Yep. Returned. Okay. Let's go over to the... Where are you at? Cedars. There you are. There it is. $76,000. There it is, guys. There it is. And now we're going to be... Oops. Turned out the wrong thing. Now we're going to be broke. Because now we got to buy some seeds. And that is not going to be cheap. Okay, how much seeds can this thing hold? It can hold... Oh, 3,100. Okay, so it can't hold tons of seeds. Let's go over here to BB's uh, seed. Oh, there we go right there. Just buy one of these. And you know what? Just buy one of those for right now. And let's start filling this thing up. So it shouldn't take that long to actually fill all the way up. Well, mostly all the way up. See it right there? That is so cool how it actually says it right there. 22,000. 2,200. Wow. Okay. Uh, let's switch that over to soybeans. Don't want to forget about that. That would suck. Planting something else. I just hope that this is going to be enough because uh, by the time we get done planting, or by the time we run out, it's going to be already past the time when the store is going to be closed. You know what? We're going to get a another one just, just in case. You never know. I want to completely fill this thing all the way up. And there we are. Okay. but And we also got more seeds here just in case. I'm just hoping we don't have to worry about that. I wish I had enough money to upgrade the engine on this thing, though. Oh, yeah. We need to put on our beacons. Okay, so first field we're going to be doing is this one over here. Oh, 
Okay. Unfold. Uh, let's actually take a look out here. Oops. You see, I'm going to have to get used to that. No more running for me. Okay. Ground is about 8% wet, so that's not too bad. Maybe we're not going to chainsaw it. Okay, let's back this thing up. Let's get on that corner right there. Okay. Lower it and turn on. Did I turn it on? I think I did. No, now I turned it on. Okay. Still trying to get used to the, using the side panel. Okay, our first crop going in the ground for the year. And it's a cash crop. Cannot wait to get this harvest. This is going to be a lot of money. Hopefully. Hopefully it's going to be a lot of money. Because I really want to get start doing some animals. I mean, yeah, chickens. Eh. I mean, actually, you know, sheep and pigs and cows. I want to get to that part of season. That's what I really want to do. Okay. You know, I'm just I'm gonna go actually in a circle for right now. That way I don't have to keep going up and down, up and down, up and down. Oh come on, get that edge, get that edge, get that edge. I'm not very I'm not a very big fan of square fields. I don't know if you guys are. If you, if you guys are a fan of square fields, let me know in the comment section below. What kind of fields do you guys prefer? Square, uh irregular shapes? You know, like circles or, you know, just weird shapes. Those are the ones I like. These roads intersect on each one I Okay, we are about done guys we have just a little bit more than we have our second field to do which I'll be doing that tonight okay so we got a little bit of the corners to do that is about it but then soybeans pretty much planted on this field that has fully been limed fully been plowed yes I just hope we can finally complete this harvest this year because last year it was really rainy so we didn't get to uh, get all of our harvest up Oh, come on. Pull up. There we go. Get a little bit more right here. Come on. Okay, that part's done. We got three more corners left to go. Turn that thing off. Three more corners and then one more field left to go and then we'll be good. I'm just hoping that uh, these germinate right and... We start seeing something soon. Because five thousand dollars and we need the money. I don't even know if we're gonna be even able to really fertilize. That is gonna be a problem. I have to talk to the bank, see if we can get maybe a little bit of a loan, maybe maybe pay them in instead of fifty thousand, maybe seventy-five thousand. Just hopefully we are good for it. Okay, there's that. Okay, it's left a little bit behind here. Ah, we're gonna have to go back around. Okay, let's go back around really quick. Let's turn those beacons off. Don't need that when we're working our own field. Okay, turn on. There we go. Okay, that's done. Okay, one more right down here.
Got that little bitty area right there. Okay. Yeah, shoe birds. And there we go. We are completely done. Did I turn that thing off? I think so. Okay, so now let's go over to our next field. Wait, you know what? Actually, hold on. Let's actually check this thing real quick. Okay. Uh, oh, that's actually 92% fertilizer over there. Is this a thing right then? 100%. No, over here is like nothing. So we might, yeah, we're going to have to fertilize. Oh, come on. I gotta check something else. Okay, let's check this. Okay, 13%. So hopefully we... Oh yeah, it's supposed to rain. So that is actually kind of a good thing then, isn't it? It's supposed to rain this summer. A lot. So we might be golden. Because let's, let's check our uh, drought capabilities. On. Oops, come on, stop, stop, stop. For soybeans, uh, low whenever it's seeded, young it is medium. So, okay, so they're gonna actually have a drought resistance whenever it's actually summertime. So that's gonna be definitely helpful. Okay, got the old, well this field left to do, and then uh, we're basically done. Okay, let's start this thing up. Ooh, geez. See what I mean by how fast it is? But anyways, guys, that is the end of the episode. Uh, when we get back, uh, this field should be done, and we should be in the summertime. So, like always, if you guys did like the video, make sure you guys pound that like button. If you have not subbed, make sure you guys do. And like always, have an all-stay farmers. Peace. Yeah.